Council not the only race being decided tonight in Sioux Falls. There are two spots open for the Sioux Falls School Board. As of this 10 o'clock hour, results still coming in. 96% of precincts reporting. The top two vote getters, well, percentage wise, it looks like they're tied. Mark Murren and Gail Swenson, each with 27% of the vote, followed by Bobby Tibbetts and Pat Starr. Hannah Eckwall in studio to tell us more about tonight's top candidates. Hannah. Brian, just a little background information. Gail Swinson is a recently retired school superintendent who spent 41 years in public education and says she has more to give for students. She looks on school board to advocate for engagement as well as school safety. Now, Mark Murin isn't new to the school board and would have seen his term end in June, but decided to rerun. Murin's reelection campaign focuses on three key components. That's attendance, reading and math, as well as school safety. Take a listen to what they had to say previously when they joined us for Meet the Candidates. Get them engaged in the vision, what the school district is about, where we're going, what our vision is. And I think that would really make a difference for our kids and their education. So school safety is huge to me. Yeah. Students and teachers have to have a safe feeling and a safe environment to, to be successful. Once the results are finalized, the winning candidates will join the rest of the school board to serve out their two-year term this coming summer. The next school board meeting will be on April 22nd at 5.30 p.m. Make sure to stick with Dakota News Now on air and online for the latest in the 2024 election. Brian. Hannah Eckwall as election night continues. Hannah, thank you.